Welcome back to this Fashion Express Thursdays here on Afternoon Express. Now, Lara Klawakowski is a designer whose work is distinct, that it becomes life imitating art. She creates high concept clothing pieces that can easily be described as wearable art. The award winning designer has been recognized by multiple South African fashion industry platforms. Now, she joins us in studio today to give more insight in her latest collection. Welcome to the studio, Lara. Thank you. Hi. <laughs> I am so blown away by just the mind you have, the incredibly creative, <laughs> very distinct mind that comes up with these gorgeous garments. I mean, where are some of your inf inspirations coming from? So with the current collection, um, I recently went overseas to Poland for a holiday and my family is Polish. Yeah. And uh, just being there and seeing all the beautiful castles and everything, all the detail and the mm -hmm. colors, that really influenced this collection. Um, but we did a road trip from the north to the south of Poland. Yeah. And what was so beautiful is that there's so many open fields, but every now and then there's a patch of sunflowers. And the texture of the sunflowers, the center points, and then the frilly petals, mm. that really left an impact on me. And I used that in the designs and uh, I created smocked pieces, uh -huh. um, so it has a kind of scrunchy sunflowery scent with the frilly bit. Um, obviously, it's more exaggerated in the clothing with bigger pieces. And more drama, of course. More drama. I'm all <laughs> into the drama. And you have not shied away from the attention to detail. Yes. I mean, with the fabrics that you use, so yes. intricate. And the time it takes, I can only imagine how long you spend in your studio. I mean, yes. how does the process <laughs> from beginning to end look like? So whenever I design a new collection, it's all about the fabric and refabricating materials mm. and creating interesting and unique textures. Mm. So with this collection, it was all about creating these smocked pieces which take hours and hours to create one piece um, and then assembling it and in a way that it sculpts the body and it's interesting and unique yeah. and they're new proportions and um, it's very organic in shape and aesthetic. So. And I can only imagine how one feels when they step into a Lara Klawakowski garment. I mean, I'm sure there's a certain power and confidence that comes with it. How do you want women to feel when they step into your wearable art? I, I would like women to feel very, very beautiful, very unique. Um, know that they are wearing something different and something that really accents, accentuates who they are and their personality and their best features of their body in a very unique and interesting way. Mm. I mean, did you set out in the beginning to create such artistic pieces? I mean, a lot of people do kind of shy away from being avant-garde and they want to become more commercial, more safe, in fact. But you are saying throwing it all to the air and putting your most, your passion into your pieces. Well, it has become more wearable over the years. Really? I'm no you longer wilder than this. Um, much wilder. Well, I love that. Um, um, well, I started my business after winning a design competition mm. and I had to design a dress made from condoms. So mm. I don't do that anymore. <laughs> I was say, are, are these still made out of condoms? <laughs> no, no. So the materials are not as unusual okay. and more wearable. So now I'm using fabrics. <laughs> um, and it still has the same aesthetics. So there's still something unique and warped and mm -hmm. there are all these little idiosyncr mm -hmm. idiosyncrasies and um, that kind of aesthetic is there, but it's in wearable materials. Beautiful. I mean, I'm ready to get along with our fashion show because I'm so excited to share your vision with our audiences. I mean, can our first model walk up this look? The color for me is so outstanding and definitely ready for spring. Yes. So talk, talk, talk to me about this look and how so, it came together. So, I mean, yeah, you can see the sunflower inspiration yeah. where you've got the smock detail, the crunchiness, and then the frilly petals. Um, and it's in one of the colors that really inspired me while I was traveling. Um, but also it has got a very signature Laura Klavikovsky feel to it, where mm. it is a unique shape. It's a unique proportion. Mm. Um, and it's very tactile and textured and yes. detailed. And, I like people to feel that when they're wearing one of my pieces, it's more than just another dress. Yeah. It's something very special and took time to make. It did take time to make and you can see the time, you can see the attention to detail. And this look for me echoes more of that sunflower vibe. Yes. Um, so, yes, yeah, so this is slightly more avant-garde. Um, but what's interesting is that when I 
10 years ago when I started my business, I would do something like this, but say in the inner tubing of a truck tire, and okay. it would be for a performance artist. But now it's in a fabric that any woman can wear, mm. and it's lightweight, and it has the signature aesthetic, but it's wearable. Stunning. Um, and whilst our last model is coming up, I know you have been celebrated and you've been kind of held up high with awards. I mean, you've won awards, you've been nominated for fashion awards. How does it feel to have your fellow peers in the industry giving you these nods? It does give you confidence in your work. Yes. Um, and it's nice to know that you're on track with what everyone's feelings in at the moment. Yeah. Um, I do tend to kind of do what I want and what I love. Pushing the boundaries. Um, but it is really great when everyone is saying, wow, this is beautiful, this is amazing, and I want to wear it, and when can we wear it? <laughs> I, I, that's why I said to you, <laughs> did I not? I was just like, this is the season. I definitely see myself yes. rocking a Lara specifically gorgeous, unique outfit. And I know if I step into any event, no one will be looking anything close to me. Thank you so much for bringing your gorgeous work to Afternoon Express. And of course, congratulations and all the Thank best you. for the rest of your fashion journey. Cool. <laughs> Stunning.